Hello. Okay, in this um, video, I'm going to try to demonstrate to you uh, the technique I want you to use for scenarios four and five, which involve kinetic friction. Remember, static friction involves the friction forces involved when there's no motion, but kinetic friction is the friction associated with when there's motion between the two surfaces something like this okay so that's kinetic friction right here all right so the way you're going to test it in scenario so in scenario four you're basically going to um, see where the, what the relationship is between kinetic friction and normal force so you'll be stacking the masses and then doing your trials in scenario five it's going to be about speed going slow medium fast uh, but the basic technique for them is the same Okay, so you're going to stack mass, and then here we go. We're going to start the trial. And unlike the first one where you were basically pulling and stopping, here it's going to be a continual, steady pull. Constant velocity is key, and you're going to pull it for several seconds, and then you're going to stop. And you're going to see, you're going to get this fairly uniform but very jaggedy value and you're supposed to read that say how can I read that it's all up and down well here's where the logger pro once again is nice you're going to basically click and drag stay away from this beginning part click and drag a part that looks pretty level of course it's going to be jagged but fairly uniform in its value then you're going to go to the stat button at the top and it's gonna tell you what the mean value was. So here it's, it says 1.44, I would chop it off at 1.4. And that's all there is to it.